So the first module at LeWagon, you'll be learning Ruby, which is a backend language, and you'll be building mini programs during the first week. Even though it's a, it's a tough week, you'll soon be inseparable with Ruby once you get comfortable with it. Module two is object-oriented programming with Ruby still, where the challenges just get a little bit bigger and more powerful. So you, uh, all the work from the first week basically pays off and you build software applications which aren't web apps yet, but they're close to, to being real things. Now that you've learned how to build your first applications, we learned during the, the third module how to store and access information about your applications in uh, real databases. Module four, we move away from backend. We now start with the front end, which is the creative part of the bootcamp where you learn everything about HTML, CSS, and how to make your application really uh, nice and user friendly. We also learn how to animate anything on your screen with JavaScript and we spent a whole week on that. Module number six is uh, really exciting because we bring everything together. Uh, we have the front end with HTML, CSS, we have animations and any JavaScript, and also we use Ruby as the backend language for Rails. And Rails is one of the frameworks that is widely used by the developer community to create web applications. So by now you must have heard that LeWagon is really uh, product focused and the last few weeks is where this really comes to life. You first built uh, an Airbnb platform, uh, any, any marketplace really, uh, from scratch and a team of three to four people. Uh, and then you move on to building your own products. So this is an idea from uh, any student, so anyone can pitch. You build that in a few weeks and then you show that off at demo day uh, in front of a crowd, which is really fun and a good way to finish a bootcamp.